Hey everybody and welcome to another edition of Where the Heck Are the Albans and Where the Heck Are the Albans? We are in Sheboygan, Wisconsin. See, I can do it without going on. Sheboygan! I swear I'm going to kill you and leave your ass in Sheboygan. <laughs> so, you know, we're in the car. You can take your mask oh, off. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, uh, what's up? See that? So, oh my goodness, it is very bright. No, it's like it's the, the sun is beating off the car next to us. Oh, I, I got it. Okay. Well, we are very bright right okay. now. But anyway, we are in Sheboygan, Wisconsin, <laughs> and we are at a place called Dellen Park. Uh, it is uh, a marina that was out here. And there's a fascinating story. Um, there was a ship that was uh, out here, and the name of the ship was called the Lottie Cooper. And it sunk. And... It was forgotten about. It just laid on the bottom. And then they made this area a marina. And when they started digging for the marina, they discovered it. <laughs> so they made it a thing over here. So let's uh, see the remains of the Lottie Cooper. So there is the marina out there that they built. And here is the remains of the Lottie Cooper. So raising the anchors. So this is the piece where the chains would go around and then they would crank it up and they would raise the, the anchors up and here is that actual piece right here. Wow. So constructing a Great Lakes schooner. So like I said, this was back from the 1800s. Uh, it sank in 1894, but uh, this would be the underneath of it. And that is what we're looking at right here. Why do, why do people have to vandalize? And, Man, look at that. It's all scratched up. You can't even read it anymore, hardly. So, providing stability for the ship. And they would, uh, would have described um, how they built the stabilizers for the ship. Wow, this is, like, fascinating. So here we are at the aft of the ship. I know that because oh. this is the, I know I'm getting all that's all technical jargon, you know? Popeye. Speech. All Popeye jargon, you got well, today it. Today is Talk Like a Pirate Day, so it, it, it is Talk Like a Pirate Day today. I didn't even think about that. It's Talk Like a Pirate Day. matey, arr. So here we are in the bowels of the boat. <laughs> and here we have a rudder. <coughs> Makes me cough. <laughs> All right, so here we're going back on the other side, and this is amazing. Sunk in 1894, and I don't know what I'm gonna have to look it up and find out. I'll put the date right here when they actually found it, uh, and then put it on display, unless it's on that big sign over there. Like a tetanus nightmare here. <laughs> September 1st, 1992. Oh, Vivi found it. What was it? September 1st, 1992. 92. Okay. So here's the uh, the plaque. Uh, Lottie Cooper crew. 1894. Lost at sea. Uh, Edward Olsen. Norway. Captain Fred L Lorenz. Lorenz. William, William Hume, Charles S. Bach, August Pagelo, and Barney Hayes. All right. And it sunk April 9th, 1894. April 9th, 1894 it sunk. Off, the off of uh, Sheboygan, off the uh, Lake Michigan here. 
during a fierce gale. Much of her original structure was salvaged September 1st, 1992, during construction of the Harbor Center Marina, which is right behind us. But this is what it actually looked like. It was a, a three-pulled mast ship. And that is interesting. So, so they're basically showing you here what we're looking at. So the dark, the dark lines and then the light lines is everything else that was lost. Wow. Very, very cool. So while we're here, we'll go down and we'll look at the lake. All right, we'll go over there. What? So here's just kind of another shot of the outside of the of the ship. And, uh, it's a pretty good size. So I hope it is not too windy and you can hear me. Uh, but uh, here is beautiful Lake Michigan. And if you are able to see land all the way across there, that is the state of Michigan across there. I don't see any land. I think you can. I can. I can barely, barely make out some land across there. Yeah. <laughs> but, uh, I don't know. It's a, if you can, that's Michigan over there. It's a mirage. And our house is many miles that way. <laughs> South. We can take... We could take Lake Michigan all We the could way. take Lake Michigan all the way to our house, just about. So there are beaches over there that uh, during the summer uh, when uh, things are normal. <laughs> and then in the winter between August and April, this is a big place for surfers. Yes. But they're surfing in literally 32 degree water. Well, a little bit above 32 degrees, otherwise it would freeze. But, well, 33. So, <laughs> but yeah, so the, the lake waters uh, in, in during that those months are usually somewhere between 33 and about 40 degrees. But this, uh, they call this the Malibu of the Midwest because there is some of the best surfing right here, believe it or not. I've seen pictures of surfers come out and then they just have ice yeah. coming down from their faces. That's crazy. But yeah. So uh, if you want some of the best surfing in the world, you come to Sheboygan. Okay, so how did you guys like the shipwreck of the Lottie Cooper? Fascinating. It was fascinating. And good old eagle eye over here got me the dates, so that's awesome. But it was interesting to see what the ship looked like. Yeah, it was. And uh, I thought that was really cool. So, um, as always, if you like what you see, give us a big old thumbs up. 
don't forget to subscribe down below. And we'll see you guys next time on Where the Heck are the Albans? <laughs> Bye, Bye, everyone.